In this video, we are going to think about how to make a 10 to subtract when we are using numbers within 20. So just a reminder that we want to know our ways to make 10. So here's that reminder. Knowing these facts will help us when we're using our 10 frames. The first way to make a 10 to subtract is by counting on. And we're going to look at that by using the equation 15 minus 8. So if I'm going to count on to subtract, I'm going to start with the 8 in my 10 frame. And then I can ask myself, how can I make a 10? Well, I see that two are missing. So I know I can add two more and make 10. So eight plus two is 10. Then I ask myself, how many more do I need to get to 15? So I'm at 10, let's count and add counters until I'm on 15. So 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Once I'm on 10, I can also just know that 10 plus 5 is 15. So now that I made it to 15, I can count how many I added to the 8 to make 15. So I can count those yellows. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 15 minus 8 is 7. Another way to think about making a 10 to subtract is by counting back. And you'll do that by starting with 15 in the 10 frames. So now I ask myself, how many do I subtract to get to a 10? I still have the goal of making a 10. And so I'm going to cross out circles until I get to where there's only circles in the top tens frame. So one, two, three, four, five. 15 minus five equals 10. So I've already subtracted five circles. So my next question to myself is, how many more do I need to subtract? Looking at the equation, I know I wanna subtract eight in total, and I've already subtracted five, so now I'm going to keep counting until I've subtracted my 8. So 5, 6, 7, 8. So now that I've subtracted 3 more to make my 8, I can count how many red circles are left, and that will be my difference or my answer. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 10 minus 3 is 7. So now I know that 15 minus 8 is 7. So that is two ways you can use making a 10 to subtract.